What is up everyone? This is Totally Random, back here with another video, but anyway guys, alright, so there's a lot of reports coming in since yesterday saying that Robert Pattinson is in talks to be playing Batman the, as the final sort of role. Uh, it was like reported by Variety saying that he was. Um, honestly, I'm a little kind of worried i was the first time i heard it, i was like i was like when he was leaked and all this stuff about not leaked but people were saying like he's he's in uh there's links there he's being linked to that role for some reason all these people are saying this and that that he's there he's being looked at uh, and i heard army hammer too i want personally at first glance i wanted army hammer because i felt like yo he's the older he's the older actor you know if they're actually looking i don't i'm still not so fully sure if ben affleck is actually being replaced completely because he really doesn't want to play. I'm not really fully sure about that, but that's what I was thinking. So I was like saying Army Hammer could actually fit in and play the role because he's older enough, you know, to fit that older Batman sort of. I mean, not that great, but like he he could play it based on what I was seeing. Uh, but that was just, that was it. Uh, that's what I was thinking. But then Army, I think Army Hammer said, no, he's not. No one's came up with him with the role. Uh, and then when Robert Pattinson, I was like, nope. Nope. When the m moment I heard him being linked to the role, I was like, hell no. I don't want this dude anywhere near it, you know? Because all I see is the guy from Twilight. I think a lot of us just see Twilight. We see the vampire from Twilight, and we see this gothic sort of, you know, like... I don't want to say weird looking. Not weird, but you know that that uh, that just vampirish look that he always had. That, But he's actually been in a lot of other movies besides that. People need to, need to go realize that and look it up. Um... Initially, you know, when Ben Affleck was announced as Batman, I was flat out so super pissed. I wasn't flat out super pissed, but I was just like, what the... He's too old. That was my first thing. He's too old, and you know, what are they doing? Ben Affleck is not Batman. He's not Batman. And then I watched the movie, and I absolutely love Batman. I think he's the greatest Batman I've ever seen, uh, personally. Even better than Christian Bale, better than George Clooney, better than uh, Michael Keaton, better than pretty much anyone I've seen, in my opinion. Like, if you go back and watch the movie, he nailed his role and what Batman was trying to do in that movie. Uh, and he, I just, he, I think, is the best Batman. I don't know if anyone's going to replace him. So, I'm going to keep my opinions about, you know, whether it works or not until I actually see the movie. I trust Matt Reeves 100%. I've loved all his movies that he's made. I'm totally behind this decision. And, you know, if it comes down between him and Nicholas Holt, the other guy uh, who played an X-Men I'm I'm actually fine. I, I you know when I look at the two actors, I think nah, uh, Nicholas Holt. You know, and that's just saying on a on a thread. I'm just saying that just because I just preferably like Nicholas Holt over uh, Robert Pattinson. But honestly, Nicholas Holt as Lantern two one eight four sent his video is a better Nightwing than a Batman. And the more I think about it, you know, you watch go back and just go back and watch Robert Pattinson's movies. He's actually a really solid actor, and he's a bit, he's a big name too, because everyone's gonna remember him from Twilight. That's another thing going forward. I, I I'm after watching this, this is a big thing. After watching Lantern 2184's video, I just my mind sort of kind of changed. It really did change. I really started to see more that hey, Robert Robert Pattinson, he could actually be pretty good, you know. And we can't just judge on based on this. You know, I see all the other YouTube channels just destroying this and lashing out and saying this is a trash decision this is bad this is bad you know so i'm saying just wait you know hold your opinions till after the movie comes out because matt reeves is a solid director i believe he's gonna he's gonna do the right thing he's gonna get it down properly but um don't don't start you know we were all, a lot of everyone was lashing out about ben affleck and look how great he turned out to be at least in my opinion and people were so many people were like pissed off that he was leaving they I, the amount of people like just going off on social media and saying why you know th this is like you know joking about look this is why the dc is going down the drain they can't even keep their own batman in you know and they were saying like why don't leave ben you're you're awesome you all this and that and i'm like didn't you all hate it at first you know and these are the same people saying like what's wrong with him why they cast him and now they're all saying oh my goodness why is he leaving he was amazing you know and the amount of people oh my goodness i've seen on social media say like this uh after um 
you know, coming back and watching Batman v Superman like a couple of years later, I, they all, they're all people saying like, I prefer Ben Affleck over Christian Bale. That's one big thing I've heard. And, you know, I think a lot of people after a while, you know, after coming back, you know, and seeing the Dark Knight trilogy and then watching, you know, Batman v Superman, they'll be like, oh, Ben Affleck actually kind of is better than Christian Bale in playing Batman specifically, you know, but with Robert Pattinson, I'm not to judge. I think he he could pull. He can play it off for sure. He's got the better chin, you know that uh that little that um the jawline specifically that fits under the mask. I think he's got that for him for sure. So I trust Matt Reeves. I think he'll do the good job. If Nicholas Holt is cast, which I don't personally want him to, if and Robert Pattinson, I think he's 32 years old, if I'm not mistaken. He's six foot one, so he is tall. He is tall. Oh, he's 33 years old. He's six foot one, so he can he has the he can fit right in, and they can make him look taller. I mean, Tom Cruise, as Lancer mentioned in his video, you know he can make the dude look like he's six foot something. Like they can definitely make Robert Pattinson look like he's six five or something. They can make him freaking look like he's Robert Gronkowski. But yeah, you guys, let me know your thoughts down below if you like this or not. I my main thing is don't judge based on what we've seen. You know, everyone's probably looking and seeing the guy from twilight look at his other movies he's been great in his other movies if you haven't watched them go watch them uh so don't just wait for it to come out wait for the first trailer the first behind the scenes look just wait i'm pretty sure he's gonna buff up he's gonna put on the muscle he's gonna gain some muscle for sure put it on he's gonna be ripped i mean this is freaking hollywood actors we're talking about um and if N N nicholas holt gets it i'm sure matt reeves has a reason for casting him uh, but the amount of people shitting on the DCEU right now is just like crazy. People still don't seem to come to terms with the fact that the DCEU at this point with the amount of films they've made has made more money than Marvel has made with these amount with the amount of films they had up to that point. So that, that's just something to say, you know, um, I believe DC will get it right. Uh, but yeah, I'm still sad to see Ben Affleck not playing it, but I hope maybe they'll do something in the future along the way. But anyway, guys, that's the video. Let me know your thoughts down below with whatever you want to say. If you think Robert Pattinson is good. My main thing is, you know, just wait for to actually see what he looks like and how he plays the role first before we actually judge. We, I will totally back you up if he is terrible in the role. I would definitely say, yeah, he's not good. It was a mistake. But until then, I'm, I'm backing it. I'm fine with it right now based on what I've seen. Not looking at Twilight. I feel like he will do a solid job under Matt Reeves' direction. But let me know your thoughts down below about that. Give me a thumbs up. Most importantly, hit that subscribe button and join my channel and make sure you hit the bell for notifications. And until next time, guys, be amazing.